Augie, the main character in the junction of Sunshine and Lucky, definitely has a sharp way of looking at the world. When she gets redistricted, Augie realizes that her new classmates have fancy plastic lunch boxes instead of brown paper sacks and are driven to school in brand new cars. Augie is embarrassed by so many things that had never crossed her mind before, like the white circles around the ankles of her jeans. Grandpa Gus buys Augie's jeans too big, so she can get more than one winner out of them. But when you take the hem out of a pair of jeans, it always leaves behind a white circle. In one of her observant Augieisms, Augie actually says that those white circles, which are also on jeans worn by her neighbors, brand them. Those white circles, she insists, are the mark that says they all live in the poor neighborhood. Augie's next door neighbor, Irma Jean, who has a talent for reinventive sewing, embroiders right over the circles on Augie's jeans before an open house Augie throws to show off the amazing updates she and Gus have made to their home. In some ways, I think that little strip of embroidery gives Augie a much-needed burst of courage before the open house, and it gives a glimpse into what a fantastic friend Irma Jean will turn out to be. It's also another example of the many ways old items throughout the junction of Sunshine and Lucky are reinvented and given brand new lives.